As many of you know, there's not a lot of good options for package managers on the Windows operating system. There's the Windows Store and Ninite, which has been one of my favorites, but Chocolatey surpasses Ninite in many areas, including the number of software packages available for download. If you've ever used AppGet or Yum on Linux operating systems, this is very similar. Chocolatey can be intimidating for some new users since it involves using the command prompt window. So I'll show you the basics and simplify the process on how to use some of the advanced functionality. That's coming up next on Tech Gumbo. Chocolatey is a free and open source package manager for Windows. If you've ever had Linux running on your computer, this will look very familiar to you. Package managers are great for installing and managing multiple programs at the same time. They do offer a pro and business version, but for most of you, the free version will be all that you need. First off, you'll need to go to chocolatey.org to install it. Then here at the very top, select install. Then scroll down the page to the installing chocolatey section and then copy this command text right here. You could either hit Control C on your keyboard or right click on it and select copy. Now you'll need to open a command prompt as an administrator. So you can go down to the search bar here, type in CMD, right click on command prompt, select run as administrator, paste the text you copied earlier and then hit enter on your keyboard. And this will install Chocolatey onto your system. Now that Chocolatey is installed, you'll first need to close it out before you can start using it. So you could either hit the X right here, or just type in exit in the command prompt window. Now let's open it back up the way we did before. Now that we have Chocolatey installed, let's get to installing some software. Here at the very top, select Packages. You'll see that they have more than 4,900 community maintained packages on their site. You'll most likely want to keep the search options as they are if you're feeling adventurous, you could change stable only to include pre-release, but we'll leave it as stable only for right now. First, I'll show you how to install a single program. Then I'll show you how to install multiple programs all at the same time. So let's find a program on the list that's currently not on my system. So I'll select 7-zip. and you just need to copy the section starting with Chaco. You don't need the section preceding Chaco. So copy it, go to your command prompt window, and paste it. And then hit enter. Now it's asking, do you want to run the script? And I'll say yes, so just hit Y on your keyboard. And now 7-Zip is completely installed. Now I'll show you how to install several programs at the same time. This works great for fresh installs on new computers, just like Ninite, but with more software to choose from. For this process, I would suggest opening Notepad or something similar. Type Chaco install. You can choose as much software as you need for this process. I'll now select three programs that I've been intending to install for a while. You could either choose from the list, but if you know what you're looking for, the search option is really useful. So the first one is Maxthon Browser. Just copy the end part after Chaco install. So I'll copy Maxthon and paste it into the editor. The next one is Notepad++. So I'll do what I did before, just copy the end part and paste it. And the last one is Spotify. 
copy Spotify here and paste it. If you want to avoid being prompted to agree to the license terms for every program, type minus Y at the end of your text so the software installation can move quicker. Now copy your text and paste it into the administrator command prompt window and then hit enter. Now it's going to install all the programs that you selected and I'll fast forward through this process to the end because this can take a couple minutes. All three programs have finished installing. I fast forwarded here to the end and it took less than a minute which was a quicker process than going directly to the websites of these companies and downloading the software individually. To make sure you're running the latest versions of your software to get the latest features and for security reasons, the upgrade process is easy. Just open the administrator command prompt window and type Chaco upgrade all and then minus Y to avoid the license term prompts. Then hit enter. Now all the software you install with Chocolatey will be updated. It couldn't be any easier than that. To uninstall a package, that process is easy too. So let's say I wanted to uninstall Spotify. Go back to the administrator command prompt window and type in Chaco, uninstall, Spotify. We'll put the minus Y at the end to avoid all the prompts and then hit enter. And it usually takes about 10, 15 seconds to uninstall. And it is done. Spotify is no longer on my system. That concludes this video. Thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if it was useful for you. And let me know in the comments your impressions of Chocolatey. And if you haven't done so already, be sure to click the subscribe button and ring the bell to be notified instantly on the latest in computer software and other tech-related stuff from Tech Gumbo.